SvelteKit 1.0 was just released, and it's pretty impressive. It's a web framework built on top of Svelte, which is popular for its clean and simple templating system with automatic reactivity, which removes a ton of code bloat. Its advanced compiler can also do really cool party tricks like this, where the dollar sign can automatically compute expressions or run reactive effects. So no need to manually list dependencies like in React, yet it's automatically optimized by the compiler. Svelte Kit handles things like your project structure, compilation, and a lot of nifty features for building full apps with Svelte. It has file-based routing with an opinionated structure where plus signs indicate files that have special behavior to the framework. Seems Rich Harris has a favorite character, just like Mishko seems to love that dollar sign. Hierarchical nested layouts are supported in Svelte using standard components and slots. And data fetching is equally simple. Add .server.js to pages or layouts, and then data exported from the load function will be available in your component as a data prop. Form handling is equally easy. Export an actions object from your server file, and then just add as many forms as you need to your page components. Forms work with JavaScript off or on, and updates can be server-side or client-side. You can also define APIs by creating a plus server.js file and exporting the verbs, like a get or post function, to handle those HTTP verbs. You can get started with SvelteKit 1.0 today by running npm create svelte at latest.